A thunderbolt from the U.S. Supreme Court today on immigration. The court upheld part of the controversial Arizona saying police can officially demand proof from the people they pull over, proof that they are in this country legally. Justices struck down other parts of the law declaring that states can't require immigrants to carry immigration papers at all times. Police cannot arrest immigrants without a warrant and ruled states cannot make it a crime for illegal immigrants to get a job in the U.S. However, pro-immigration groups say the so-called show-me-your-papers law will lead to racial profiling. Uh, we think that the show-me-your-papers law is the most divisive, destructive piece of that law and that that's the one that you know, anti-immigrant legislators in our sti state may take as a green light to try and enact similar types. So we think the whole thing should have been struck down. The decision is being praised primarily by Republicans, including Tennessee Congressman Diane Black, who released this statement saying, quote, states bear the burden of all of the federal government's inaction, and they are proactively looking for ways to keep their citizens safe and alleviate the financial strain caused by illegal immigrants. She says, I'm glad that the Supreme Court has allowed for at least one of these solutions to stand.